hello in this video i am going to show you how you can install windows 11 operating system on your computer it doesn't matter whether you have old computer or new computer every computer is supported by this method so let's see how we can do this step by step at first we need to open any browser i am going to use google chrome browser for this tutorial and i am going to open google.com once we are in the google.com we just need to type download windows 11 and then we have to hit enter key we'll find download windows 11 link over there we just need to click here and the windows 11 download page will be there shortly which here in this page we just need to scroll a little bit down over there we'll find download windows 11 disk image iso file for this case so this is the uh, software or iso file we need to download before the installation so i'm going to choose the download type so i'm going to choose windows 11 and then i have to press this download now once we click download now button it will ask us to choose a language i'm going to choose english language for this tutorial but it's fine if you choose any other language also so i'm going to choose it and then i'm going to press this confirm button once i press the confirm button it will bring this type of button go to download I'm going to click here to start downloading Windows 11 and very shortly it will be downloaded. After the download is finished, then we'll find a ISO file like this. This is the ISO file for our Windows 11. Now we will use it to install Windows 11 on our computer. So at first we need to mount it. We can mount this ISO file very easily. For any computer, right click and then you'll find the mount option is there. And if there is that is not there, then we can use other option. So here I'm seeing the mount is there. And also if the mount option is not available, then we can use Windows software to extract all of this file. I mean the ISO file. And I'm going to choose mount for this video. And once it is mounted, then we'll find these files are inside that folder or that drive. And these files we need to copy. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to select all of these files and then right click copy this thing. Now I need to paste it to any a location of our computer. For our case, we just need to access our C drive. So it is looking like this. Then I just created on folder like Windows 11. Now I'm going to access that folder and I'm going to paste all files which I copied before after mounting. And it looks like this. So here check the path properly. It's on C drive windows 11 folder and every files and folders are there now i'm going to open the command prompt in admin mode and now i need to write this command setup.exe then space slash product then space server you need to write the exact command otherwise it will not be loaded i mean you cannot install the operating system of windows 11 on your computer so once you type it now hit the enter key once you hit the enter key then you'll find this type of window this is the installation window of our windows 11 operating system here there is a link change how setup downloads update is there we just need to click here to access the option you will find two options are there and there is also next button but i'm not going to press the next button right now before that i'm going to click here change how setup downloads update so once i click this on it will go to the next step and it will ask us what we need to do there are two options on one is it will download the latest thing everything latest like uh, operating system or some features everything and there is not right now i just downloaded windows 11 so i don't need to download anything so i'm going to choose not right now this option once i choose the not right now this option then i'm going to press the next button i just type i press next button and it is on the next page here it is uh, checking my computer uh, to install windows 11 it will take few minutes so be patient don't close this window and once the checking process is done then we'll be in this type of page here it is the license agreement we are going to install windows 11 so we must accept the license so there are two buttons one is accept and there is decline to start the installation or to install windows 11 we must have to accept this license so I'm going to press this exit button and once I press the exit button, then we'll be in this page. Here it is asking different options are there. Keep files, settings and apps, 
skip previous files only nothing if we, if we want to install only fresh install of windows and by formatting our computer then we have to choose nothing but if we want to keep our documents then we have to choose the first option so i'm going to choose that and then i'm going to press the next button and then it is giving me the option like ready to install and there is a button install so i'm going to press this final install button to start the installation once i press the install button we cannot go back it will start installation one by one step everything and when it will start installation it will look like this it will take some time to complete the installation so we need to wait till it finishes installation once the installation is done then we need to log in and after that we are going to access the c drive and here we are seeing that windows 11 and windows.all two folders are there i'm going to delete both of them because we don't need it anymore and that's it our windows 11 is ready to use so in this way we can easily install windows 11 operating system to any computer without using any flash drive on pen drive and the cool thing is that this exact technique will applicable to all versions of windows or desktop it doesn't matter whether you are using old computer or new computer everywhere it will work but for old computer the windows 11 will be slow but for new computer it will be super fast so that's it guys hopefully by watching this video you are able to install windows 11 on your computer if you face any issue or if you have any question please put in the comment section thanks again for watching the video